raising money in London that's destined to save lives in Somalia. Thank you, thank you so much. This community in Brent is being reminded of its roots and urged to do what it can to help. Thank you so much. And we're trying our best to help our people back home who are suffering hunger and no water. And you see, we, we, they go through a hard time and I stand up to help with them and, and I, I always do that. Let's just do my best. It's a campaign started by the Brent Somali Community Centre, the very definition of grassroots. Their office is at the back of a second-hand clothing shop. Humble beginnings, but with great ambitions. It's not even about like schools or, or, or going to school or going to work anymore. It's about surviving. Children younger than us, children that, that haven't even gone to school yet, dying from lack of water. We need to urge everybody to contribute. I mean, everybody's aware, but the problem is not everybody wants to sometimes you know, go into their pockets and just be like, right, I'm going to donate. Shops all along the high street in Harleston are doing their bit. The large collection jar in the butchers is almost empty, only because they've already filled it once. But well, now we collect for 850 now at the moment in five days. We have now, we continue to, to donate for hunger people in Somalia. So you've already collected, collected 850 in five days? Yeah. The fundraising is not part of the Disasters Emergency Committee campaign. This is personal. Money being sent back to friends and families who are in desperate need. Because everybody who are Somali who live in this country, they may have a relative or friend.